Hey everyone, I'm sitting here with John Goldwater from Archie Comics. Hey. John, how's it's, it going? It's going great. Yourself? Uh, great. Great. And congratulations on all of the Archie Comics success. Yeah, it's it's a remarkable, amazing, and thrilling all at the same time. When when did you guys first think, okay, Riverdale is something that we can we can tweak and put out there like this? Well, I mean, I actually been thinking about it for years. Um, and we started when we started transitioning what we were doing in the comic books and doing a more modern take. Um, and then I met uh, Roberto Aguirre Sacasa, who's the showrunner of Riverdale, and he became chief creative officer of Archie. And then off to the races we went. You updated the comics. You went to the horror with the, um, after, 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 li after Life with Archie and, and the, the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. And then Jug had the hunger. And Jug, Jug had the hunger. Yeah. And, wait, and Vampironica. Oh, Vampironica, yeah. We yes. have Vampironica as so well. You have so. this whole world going on, then you get this show, and then you get the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina deal to spin her off, I guess, technically? Yeah, I mean, it's its own thing. You know, I mean, Sabrina's always been kind of part of the Archie universe, but in this series, she is strictly in Greendale, and it's strictly her thing and her life and her story. What you guys are working on now is in the vein of Riverdale, but I feel like with where it's going on the streaming service, you guys can really get into the horror roots. One of the fun things about being on Netflix and not being on broadcast is that we can take some real chances. It's going to definitely be Rosemary's Baby, The Omen, things like that. You know, it's going to be a fun show. It's going to be pretty fun. When you watch Riverdale and you see that cast absolutely nailing these characters that people have known for so many years, what goes through your head? Well, a couple things. I mean, first, I'm so fortunate to have this cast. I mean, the fact that they've made these characters come alive and people love them, it's like, it makes me feel like, truly, I'm the luckiest person on the planet Earth. I mean, I can't believe it. I can't believe how big the show's gotten in the most wonderful way. So uh, I feel blessed every day. Do you have a specific Archie comics storyline that you'd love to see portrayed on screen? I mean, I gotta tell you, you know, they're kind of hitting every note right now. I mean, one thing about Riverdale, is that it, it really is based in the comic books in that it's still a show about friendship and it's still a show about family. Now, granted, it's a little twisted compared to, you know, the old school Archie, but it's still rooted in friendship and it's still rooted in family and it has the DNA of Archie. And, and, and that makes me feel really, really pleased. Excellent. John, congratulations on all the success. Thank I you, can't Damian. wait to see I Sabrina. I appreciate it. Oh, that's awesome. Thank, Thank you, you so much for stopping by.